Hey everyone, it's Blake Bundy here from Winning Solutions Inc. And today I will be bringing you guys another Microsoft Access Expert Template Walkthrough. I will be showing you guys where to find the template database on our website, how to download the template database demo, and how to use the demo properly. Most of our templates are not designed to be used on their own. Instead, they are designed in a way that makes it simple and smooth to integrate it into an already existing database that you have already been using. You can also build a more robust Microsoft Access database that is built around one of our templates. If you would like to create a new database that is based off of one of our templates and don't know how or do not have the time to do so, let us know and we would be happy helping you with getting the database that 100% fits your needs. With most of our templates that we offer, there's three different versions that you can purchase. A compiled runtime version, one for internal use, and one for unlimited developer use. Our, our compiled runtime version is a run as is version without the paid full version of Microsoft Access using the free Access runtime from Microsoft. It can be integrated into your existing Access application, but you would not be able to make any modifications to the forms, the reports, the modules, etc. This option is more for those of you who do not see any need to make any customizations to the template. Our internal use version allows you to use or modify the databases however you wish within your organization. And last but not least, our unlimited developer use version allows you to use the database template however you wish for any applications you develop and distribute the template as part of a database you create. Winning Solutions Inc.'s templates have a strong advantage over shrink wrap software that you purchase from a store or website. With our templates, you receive the source code along with your purchase so you are able to customize and update the database as you please. With shrink wrap software, you do not receive the source code when purchasing the software, which means that you cannot update or customize the database as you wish. In our video today, we will be working on a demo version of our database template. A demo is a simple way that you can view and try out our database templates so that you can determine if you would like to purchase it or not. This is great for customers due to the fact that all of our sales are final. Our sales are final because when we, we give you the source code when you purchase the template. And once we give you the source code, there is really no way that you can return the code. If you'd like to test out our demos for multiple days, you are free to do so. All you have to do is leave the database open so that the data you enter will not be wiped. That is because our demos are designed so that once you close the demo, all the data that you have entered will be wiped from that database. You have to purchase the full version if you would like to save your data that you have entered. Upon downloading a demo for one of our templates, you will have to unzip the downloadable file. Zip files make it much easier to send and download large files over the web. Unzipping a file is a very simple step. All you have to do is extract the file so that you have access to the uncompressed file. If you do not know how or do not understand how to unzip a file, check out our YouTube channel and watch the How to Unzip One of Our Files video tutorial to learn this simple step. The link to that video will be in the description of this video. So now, let us get into downloading and testing out one of our templates. We're going to start off here by going to our website at microsoftaccessexpert.com. As you can see, I have been here before. On the top of our website, there's going to be a toolbar with all the various ways that you are able to contact Winning Solutions, Inc. You're going to want to click on the sidebar button on the left side of our homepage that is labeled Database Templates for Sale. A sublist then opens up and you need to select the Database Templates List button to view the list of all of our templates that we offer. The list is broken up into categories. The different categories that we currently have are our most popular ones, appointment and scheduling databases, calendars databases, reservations and booking databases, contact and communications databases, task management databases, equipment and maintenance tracking databases, 
sales databases, employee databases, education databases, small business databases, and last but not least, database tools and miscellaneous templates. Today, we're gonna to be taking a look at the Microsoft Access Faculty Database Template. So if you scroll up a little bit here and go to the education section right here, go ahead and click the Access Faculty Database. Once that web page opens, go to the download a demonstration section and download a demo that correctly corresponds with the current version of Microsoft Access that your computer is running on. I'm going to download this one. Once it downloads, I'm going to open the file and the file is zipped up so you're going to need to extract all of its contents before you can open it. Hit extract all then hit extract. Once you've extracted the file, you can now open the file. And with all of our database templates, since they do come from the web, your computer views it as a potential security risk or concern. Now I can assure you that this database template is safe, so I'm going to go ahead and continue on and open the file. And as always with the database templates, you also get this pop-up box just stating that this is a demo version of the database template. If you want to store the data that you enter, you need to purchase the full version. You all, this pop-up box also has all the different ways you can contact us. Feel free to contact us whenever you like. I'm going to go ahead and close out of this for now. So this is within our education section because it's meant for a faculty for a school. However, this could work for a fac uh, your faculty for any organization that you run. It's pretty simple. If it just keeps track of your faculty's information. So if you go to faculty to begin and you go to add new faculty, you're just adding a new faculty member. So we're just going to create some test information for the sake of this demo. But as you can see, you can put in a lot of information about each faculty member. You can have a phone number, you can have their address, you can even have a picture of the uh, faculty member, notes about them, um, give them a unique faculty ID, what type they are, are they since this is based for a school. However, if you purchase a database template, you can change it. So this is based for education. So as you can see, they have a lecturer, a principal, professor, substitute teacher, teacher, vice principal, uh, education related roles. So we'll just put professor, you can put them in different departments, English, mathematics, all that good stuff. You can also have their employment information. So maybe their ID number, we gave them the ID number one, one. So their ID number is one. You can put in their date of birth, their date of hire, their salary, whether it's hourly or full salary. Um, their previous education, do they have their GED, do they have a bachelor's, do they have a master's degree, and even, even put what school they went to, as well as emergency information about that faculty member. So if you needed uh, an emergency contact for each faculty you have, you could store that information within here and it would automatically save uh, and be attached to that faculty member. And you can even put in medical information about them, maybe if they have some certain allergies like a peanut allergy, anything like that, you can put that in as well back to general we're gonna go ahead and hit save and new so now a new pop-up box shows up but we just created one so we're not gonna make another one so if we close that now we can search for that faculty member now since I, I've only created one he's gonna show up right away so if I start to type in Blake and hit search as you can see you can search my first name last name email or faculty ID there we go that name shows up Blake test and you can even double click this faculty member and the pop-up box shows back up where you can edit any more information or add in some new information about them. This would be perfect for if you had a ton of faculty members, you need to quickly search through them to find information about each faculty member. So close this for now. So it's a pretty simple database, but like I said, it'd be perfect for an education group if you need to keep track of all your faculty or another organization that just wanted to keep track of their faculty members as well. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to thank you all for taking your time to watch this Microsoft Access Expert Database Template Walkthrough brought to you by Winning Solutions Inc. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to like or subscribe to our YouTube channel for tons of other walkthroughs and tutorials. As always, contact us for any of your IT needs. Whether you need programming done, you want to buy a template, you need to further develop a database, customize a template, anything. Feel free to contact us whenever you'd like. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to post our contact information in the description below of this video. As always, you can find us on about all social media platforms. Feel free to follow us or like us on any of those websites we post quite frequently. Once again, thank you all for watching this Microsoft Access Expert Database Template Walkthrough and have a great day.